It's the NFL on EA Sports as we are in the inner harbor of Baltimore at M&T Bank Stadium. Today, it's an AFC North matchup between the Cleveland Browns and the Baltimore Ravens. to get us started it's Cade York and off we go from M&T Bank Stadium Start on the ground with Dobbins. They find some open field here. Taking it right down Broadway. And all the way in for a Ravens touchdown. Wow, first play of the game, CD. 75 yards. These people, they haven't even filed in yet from the tailgate lots. Everyone talks about starting out fast. Everyone talks about getting explosive type plays. That was absolutely a thunderbolt. And on the defensive side, he spent all week scheming, all week preparing, and it seems like it goes right out the window. Tucker with the extra point, and that makes the score 7-0. Kick it away following the touchdown. Takes it at the 7. And he'll take it up past the 25 to the 26-yard line. They start on the ground with Nick Chubb. And not a whole lot there. Maybe a yard to the 27. Not a whole lot there. The defense was ready, it looked, for that run pass option. You get the sense the next time he has that opportunity, he may keep it himself and get to the perimeter. Probably owes his back a little bit of an apology on that one, huh? On second and nine, Brissett. And that is incomplete. A lot of force bearing down on him there. He could not hang on. It's third down. And then with a dime look on defense, two extra defensive backs on the field have covered up essentially every blade of grass. That allowed them to disrupt the play. After an incomplete pass on second down, that'll leave him trying to convert on third and nine. To throw is Brissett. And he fires one that's intercepted. Kyle Hamilton picks it. And they will finally bring this run back to an end, but not before he's down inside the five-yard line at the four. He had his eyes on the end zone. He got close. At least he set the offense up nicely, but he's probably mad he didn't take that one to Painter. I agree with you, and you know he's going to get teased because he did. And he will take it in for a Ravens touchdown. Mike Davis taking it in from four yards out. And the Ravens are able to strike quickly to add on to their lead. Tucker able to connect on the extra point, And it's now 14 to nothing. Tucker now to kick it away following the touchdown. Fielded right around the eight.
The Browns drive about to get started. And they're in an early hole. The first drive, they threw the interception. That led to a touchdown. So, decent-sized deficit early on. It is, but I think you hit the key words, early on. So they have to decide, do we even need to change game plan? Or do we just need to execute better and try and get back in this game? Nine yards is the pick up there, and they'll have a second and one. And again, it's Chubb. They'll get three as the drive continues. It's a first down. I know what you're thinking out there. I know a lot of you are thinking, take a shot downfield. It's a great spot for it. I'd say maybe later in the game, definitely in the second half. But right now, I think they were just trying to get some momentum built. Get a first down, pick it up, and keep moving. And he is met quickly in the backfield. Down he goes, folded like a lawn chair. They'll lose a yard there, and it's second and 11. Clock rolling as we hit the midway point of this first quarter. On second and 11 now, Brissett looking deep in the direction of Cooper. And that will be incomplete. Tried to dial up the long one way out there, but it'll be third down. But they certainly came out firing in this one, and while that one was incomplete, I can't imagine that would be the last shot that they take in this game. On third down, Brissett. Swings this out for Hunt. And he'll be taken down well before the first at about the 36-yard line. That's going to bring up fourth down, only a gain of two there. Here's Corey Bajorquez now. And he gets this away, angled for the sideline with a lock behind it. Wow. And this one's out of bounds. Should be inside the 10, I think. It 